A seemingly throwaway line from Avengers Endgame got some comic fans' attention, as it just may have teased the arrival of a classic Marvel hero for Phase 4 of the MCU. Or on the other hand, maybe it hasn't. Such is the state of studies at Marvel Cinematic University, better known as MCU of course. Be advised that major spoilers for Endgame follow. During his mission to secure more pin particles at the S.H.I.E.L.D. base in 1970, Steve Rogers finds himself in the office of director Peggy Carter. He's taken aback by his proximity to his long-lost flame and the picture of him lovingly displayed on her desk. And let's be honest, so is the audience. It's a poignant, heartstring-tugging moment, so it's pretty easy to miss what Peggy seems to be saying as Rogers gazes at her through the office window. According to one intrepid Reddit poster who claims to have seen the flick with a closed captioning device, Carter says, Braddock hasn't checked in. I'm not a meteorologist and it's not lightning. Now, we haven't been able to directly confirm that this is the dialogue she speaks, and you probably know to take the average Reddit post with a grain of salt in terms of its overall reliability. Additionally, Carter delivers the dialogue while she's in another room, so the line itself is pretty hard to hear without the aid of a closed captioning device. But if the post is accurate and Carter does mention Braddock, it could very well be referring to a classic Marvel character who has yet to show up in the MCU. Brian Braddock better known as the super-powered Captain Britain. Making his first appearance in Captain Britain issue number one in 1976, Brian Braddock was a graduate of London's Thames University. Working as a physicist on an experiment involving antimatter particles under Dr. Hugo Travis, when a villain descended on the facility to steal the research, Braddock fled to get help, but crashed his motorcycle and sustained what would have been fatal injuries. And that's when his story took a turn for the weird. On the verge of death, Braddock was discovered by none other than Merlin, the legendary wizard of English folklore. Sensing Braddock's heroic heart, Merlin gave him a choice of two objects, the Sword of Might or the Amulet of Right. Not believing himself to have the heart of a warrior, Braddock chose the amulet, and upon receiving it, he was transformed into Captain Britain, with his own snazzy costume and a bunch of superpowers like super strength, super endurance, and flight, among others. Captain Britain isn't the only prominent hero named Braddock in Marvel Comics lore. The other is his twin sister, Betsy Braddock, who eventually became the superhero known as Psylocke. She showed up in 20th Century Fox's X-Men Apocalypse in 2016, played by Olivia Munn. But Captain Britain does seem like a more likely candidate for a future appearance in the MCU for a few reasons. For starters, Psylocke's own comic book origin story is even more bonkers than the one we just described for Captain Britain. Not only that, but Psylocke's status as a member of the X-Men cast of characters means it's pretty unlikely she or any of the other Marvel mutants will show up in the MCU too soon, since Disney's acquisition of 20th Century Fox is still so fresh. More importantly, however, is the fact that Marvel Studios boss Kevin Feige has actually admitted that he and his colleagues have discussed bringing Captain Britain into the MCU. In 2017, during the press tour for Spider-Man Homecoming, Feige was asked about the potential status of a cinematic version of Captain Britain. We have discussed it. We have discussed it. There are a lot of actors that come in and ask about that, <laughs> about that part, um, so we'll have to see. Could this be the first hint that Captain Britain is coming? Could there be yet another Captain being added to the MCU? Or is this just one wild goose chase based on a misheard line of dialogue? When it comes to the Marvel Cinematic Universe, all things are possible. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more Looper videos about Avengers Endgame are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.